Have you ever asked yourself the question, how does Pavel Tsatsulin train? A quick Google search led me to this great bodybuilding.com article. It states that Pavel's program focus on minimalism. This is one powerful core tenet that I have applied to my training schedule as well. And one of his programs jumped at me from the start. The five times five times five mind over muscle system. So here's my personal spin on Pavel's program since we want to confine its structure to kettlebell exercises only. So let's check out the exercises first. Exercise number one is five reps of the double deadlift. Make sure the kettlebells are inside the middle of your foot. Push your hips back. Your upper body leans forward. You grab both kettlebells straight back. Now you breathe in through the nose before you lift the kettlebells. Once you are on top, you release a little bit of air while keeping that pressure in your abdominals. And once you drop the kettlebells down to the floor, you release the air fully. Exercise number two, we do five reps of the double press make sure your elbows stay connected to your body you breathe in through your nose before you start pressing once the kettlebells in the top fixation you release a little bit of air now you bring the kettlebells back into the rack position you release the air fully and you make sure that the elbows stay connected to each other so when the kettlebells travel into the top fixation we cover a short distance exercise number three is five reps of the double reverse lunge a great neutralizing exercise after the press Think about standing on tram lines and not on a tight rope. This means we keep standing in that shoulder width position. You breathe in through your nose, you take a step back, your knee touches the ground, make sure your knee as well as your hip have that 90 degree angle. Now you come back into the shoulder width position and this is where you release the air fully. Exercise number four is five reps of the double front squat. This is a tough one. You stand a little bit wider than shoulder width apart. Your feet are turned outwards. You push your knees out and you try to keep your chest as upright as possible on your way down as well as on your way up. Here we need a lot of intra-abdominal pressure. So you're breathing through your nose before you go down. And even if you reach the bottom position, do not breathe out. When you reach the starting position on top, this is where you release the air fully and relax for a couple of seconds. The final exercise is 100 meters with a farmer's walk. Go heavy on this one. You grab both kettlebells in the suit case position you deadlift it and then you start walking keep your chest up your shoulders back and enjoy this great and powerful low-tech exercise the minimalist approach to this training schedule makes it easy to digest we do five reps per exercise and we do five working sets per exercise always leaving a couple of reps in the tank i intentionally deviate from pavel's routine since his focus in that regard is mostly on barbell exercises now since we are using kettlebells five sets should add enough volume to compensate for this now let's talk about weight selection beginners might want to stick to the same weight throughout all exercises females you start with double 8 kg and males you start with double 12 kg advanced folks choose the following weights and write it down for the deadlift females use double 28 kg and males use double 44 kg for the press females use double 14 kg and males use double 22 kg for the reverse lunge females use double 14 kg and males use double 22 kg for the front squat females again use double 14 kg and the males as well double 22 kg for the farmer's walk females use double 28 kg and males use double 44 kg now you have to treat rest as an integral part of the workout not just as a mere necessity if you checked out some of our workouts before then you know this is the way we do it on this youtube channel we don't believe in the burn mentality we believe in technique staying safe and having fun to work out throughout the year and staying injury free it's totally fine if we need additional rest because since we are confined to kettlebells and strict weights leaving a couple of reps in the tank as pavel points it out to be in that protocol means to me that enough rest in our case is necessary even in between reps so thank you for watching if you liked the video like it and consider subscribing and let me know down in the comments what you think about my spin on pavel's five times five times five mind over muscle system 90 days of kettlebells is an online workout course for beginners who want to train at home lose weight and achieve lasting results without wasting time and money with crash diets 
and unused gym memberships. The program works as follows. You will do three kettlebell workouts per week that gradually increase in difficulty. You'll also build three powerful eating habits that have proven successful in our coaching. As the name implies, the program lasts 90 days and you will have lifelong access after purchase. We also include live accountability sessions where you will publicly state your goals. Psychology shows us that if we make our goals public, our adherence to the process and the program increases dramatically. If you have been struggling to put together an elaborate kettlebell workout system while trying to lose weight, then 90 days of kettlebells is for you. The price of 90 days of kettlebells is 59 US dollars per month for three months, and you can save 20% with a one-time payment of 147 US dollars. We'll open registration only to a small number Number of new clients. Join the waiting list now to get access 24 hours before the general public. Link is in the description.